Question 31. What happens as a result of mitosis? So, mitosis is the cell division for the body cells. As we talked before, so body cells are different from sex cells, so-called gametes. So, sex cells or gametes are like sperms or eggs. They have 23 chromosomes inside, for humans, of course. So they are called haploids because they don't have pairs of chromosomes. They only have single chromosomes, single sets of chromosomes like this. So there are 23 chromosomes like this. Same goes for this you know, egg. But for body cells, these guys don't have single sets. They have pairs of chromosomes. Therefore, they are called diploids. Because they have pairs of chromosomes. So for humans, body cells, each body cell has 46 chromosomes. They're like chromosomes in pairs like this. So the cell division for body cells called mitosis aims to produce many clones as the original. Oops, broken one. Here we go. this. But if you come to think of it, if you divide 46 chromosomes into half, then you get 23 chromosomes, right? But how do they have 46 chromosomes? This is because the cell that wants to go under the process of mitosis replicates its DNA. It initially had 46 chromosomes, and then it goes into the process of DNA replication, meaning that it just replicates DNAs or chromosomes, you can say. And what happens is now the chromosomes numbers, or chromosome numbers are doubled. And then if you divide into half, if you divide the chromosome numbers into half, then you get 46 chromosomes each in, um, in the cells. So when it happens, since I said, or well, since they are, they, they contain exactly the same chromosomes, they are genetically, genetically um, identical, meaning same. So does it produce gen uh, genetically identical cells? Yes. So it's either A or B. Is the chromosome number halved? No. It's exactly the same. So the answer is B. And we will probably talk about meiosis later. Uh, meiosis is, is different from mitosis because it's not the division of body cells, but it's the division of sex cells. Strictly speaking, it's not really division of sex cells. It's actually division of cells to make, to make sex cells, like sperms or eggs. So a cell gets divided twice to make four cells instead of two cells that is produced by mitosis. And they are all non-identical, non like genetically, genetically non-identical. So therefore, 
when meiosis happens, in men, they produce a lot of sperms like this. And each sperm has different chromosomes, different genetic, uh, genetic materials. And that's called meiosis. But we will talk about this later when we, can, um, when we have time. But for, for the being, um, the result of mitosis always produce genetically identical cells and the chromosome numbers are conserved. So they, are, they stay the same. Okay?